guys, what's up? My name is Prez and welcome to another episode of NHL. Be a goalie. I hope you guys are enjoying NHL week. If you are, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, we're about 14 days away from NHL 17, guys. So in 14 days, we'll have a new game to play. We'll have a new year, fresh start, brand new game, brand new series coming out. Like multiple series is coming out. For NHL 17, uh, I have leaked, I have accidentally posted about three of them, or two of them, or like one of them you guys already know, I'm already going to do NHL Be a Pro series, but I leaked kind of, I kind of accidentally, I did this a couple months ago and I didn't want to bring this up, but I thought it was pretty funny, um, that, uh, that I'm going to make different series, obviously, with, uh, with NHL Be a GM, I kind of released that, and then NHL 17 World Cup of Hockey, uh, that's coming out too. That's going to be like tournament style type of thing. So that series won't last that long. Um, but there's obviously multiple series coming out and all that stuff. I'm just getting set because YouTube, you can actually set a thumbnail for for different playlists and all that stuff. So I decided to do that and I accidentally uploaded. Uh, I've actually made them public um, accidentally. So I did that a couple months ago. You guys will see that and you guys will see more in the next coming weeks. As the game is about to get released. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying NHL week. But anyways, let's get started. We're faced off against the Toronto Maple Leafs. We are the Edmonton Oilers, of course. We are on the Edmonton Oilers. We're playing against the Toronto Maple Leafs. So let's get it started. Um, oh yeah, I don't summon anything because I actually got onto the team and I don't want to mess it up. So um, yeah, so we're going to change the difficulty. Like I said, I keep on changing it back to... Uh, rookie, but I don't know why it keeps on not. It doesn't save it for some reason. I have to go back to like the actual settings and change it. The reason why I put it on rookie, I want to get used to the controls. I haven't played this game. I haven't played this game mode in quite a while. As you guys know, I took a break. I took a week off uh, from actually recording videos. I recorded like one video during the whole week, and um, my my phone is going off. Thanks, Gmail, for breaking that shit. Um, but anyways, I took a week off and, uh, I took a week off and I made one video during the whole week was NHL 17 franchise mode, which is another series that's coming out. Um, um, but anyways, we're going to skip this. We're not going to listen to them anyways. Here we are. We are back in behind the posts. Uh, it's, it's, it's good to be back here. It's good to be back here. All right, we got Van Riemdijk, we got Kadri, we got Lupo coming up. Lupo with just the bad pass right there. We're going to switch views here so you guys can get you. There's Riley, there's Kadri, there's Van Riemsdijk or JVR, if you want to put him down that name. Oh, there's a nice save, nice save by me. We're going to hug the post, hug the post. Posts are best friends, posts are our best friends. We right, got Taylor Hall coming up here. Oh, we got Emery. Oh, come on. McDavid was right there. And like the Sidney Crosby slot. The Sidney Crosby slot. I call it the Sidney Crosby slot because he's always there. He's always at the side of the net. And even even Ovechkin's always at the side of the other side of the net too. So being at the side of the net apparently makes you score goals. So we're actually at the Air Canada Center. I've been here about seven or eight times in actually real life. Even though I'm not a Toronto fan, I've been to Toronto games tons of... I've been to more Toronto games than I have my favorite team, obviously, because my favorite team is the Anaheim Ducks. And uh, it's not cheap to go to California. It's not It's not cheap to go to California. And I've never been to California. The furthest I have been into the States is Boston, um, which is technically not even really that far. It really took like an hour a plane flight to get there, really. And then... We came back from Boston. We just got laid over for like two or three hours. We got laid over because of a snowstorm. And uh, so we had to sit in the Boston airport for a couple hours. I was over. I was over to save that. God damn it. Yeah, but anyways, I've been here tons of times. I've been into the Toronto like suites where like you pay literally thousands of dollars to go to and to actually sitting where you actually get like free food, free drinks, everything. I told this story before, but 
I got newer subscribers now, and they don't they don't really don't know. Um, but at the Air Canada Center, there's different there's different like they're called premium booths. Um, they're premium seats. Basically, you pay about three to five grand for them, and uh, basically you get served pretty much anything you want. If you want to get a pizza made, they'll make you a pizza. Like that's the type of like service you get, and you get unlimited drinks. Unlimited food, and uh, sometimes you actually get to meet the players. Sometimes the players come up, or like the commentators, or like sometimes they come up and like see you and say hi and blah blah blah. But anyways, I was in the um, they had this they had this uh, goalie on the Toronto Maple Leafs called Curtis Joseph. Curtis Joseph is a really really good goalie. He's played for the Leafs, and we're acting we're actually in the Curtis Joseph suite. Uh, he actually had his own suite named by him, so we had the Curtis Joseph suite, and I actually got the tickets for free, so I didn't have to actually pay for them, which is fucking very lucky, because they're like five grand, and I don't have that type of money. Also, when I was a kid, I didn't have that type of money, so I got them for free, and uh, so, yeah, so that was actually pretty cool. It was a pretty cool experience. We got Austin Matt. Why is Matthews? Is Austin Matthews actually on the roster? I mean, like... Yeah, I must say, updated the roster. That was really weird. Or Austin Matthews has already been on the team already. I don't think. Is that Austin Matthews? I don't think that's Austin Matthews. I think about something. Another Matthews. Is that Austin Matthews? And uh, be, no, Sean Matthews. All right, Sean Matthews. Sorry, sorry to all of the two Leaf fans that watch. Uh, I mess up the names. I always mess up players' names, so don't worry. I mess up everybody's names. I'm really bad with names, so don't hold that against me. Kadri taking it offside. <laughs> Kadri taking it offside. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna do it like I did before. I'm gonna cut out the second period just to I don't know, just to bring this video down in time and uh, all that stuff. So and also take me break from talking because I don't feel like talking for another fucking twenty minutes or another four minutes basically. But it's four minutes per period, but between like the face-offs and the whistles and the pauses and all that stuff, so it takes a little bit longer than four minutes. I can tell you guys, it takes about ten minutes per period to actually record one of these. So it actually takes ten minutes per period to actually record this. So it takes a long time to actually record this. I'm drinking more water. I'm trying to get into shape, obviously for hockey when I play hockey. Um, this coming September or next year, I really want to get into shape, obviously. And uh, so I'm drinking more water and less pop. I actually haven't drinking pop in the past couple of days. Well, I haven't drank pop for the past like two weeks. I just been drinking water and juice, and uh, that's about that's about it. So I'm also going to start like eating well and uh, all that stuff. So I'm going to get into hockey shape, uh, basically. So. I'm also going to make a video on how, like, all the gear that I have. It's all the same brand, and uh, that's what I like. It's all made by the same brand, and the brand that I really, really love, too. So, it's awesome that I can get all the matching. It's not all matching. It's not the same, like, number. Like, they go by series. So, my gloves are made for a different series, and then my pants, shin guards, and elbow pads are part of the same series and my helmet's part of a different series so it's all it's all mixed and match but it's all the same it's all the same company and uh i'll make a video um probably this weekend of it if i i just need to get shoulder pads once i get shoulder pads and i have a complete set and then obviously i need the like the little stuff like the the under armor and uh jock and neck guard and all that stuff because the, the league that i'm playing in requires you wear a neck guard and also like a full cage. So I have to wear a full cage, neck guard, and obviously jock, protect the jewels, because you don't want to get a puck in the jewels. Cause that shit fucking hurts. It really hurts, trust me. I've gotten the puck there before. And uh it wasn't it wasn't pretty. It wasn't pretty. It hurts so much. Even with a cup, even with a cup protecting your nads. It still hurts. Like, it still hurts. Like, no matter what, you can't... If you're... Say you're blocking a puck about 80 miles an hour and it hits you right in the fucking jock, it still hurts. 
it doesn't hurt as much. Also, your balls won't get fucking damaged. You won't have to go to the doctor and get them fucking surgically removed. It, it still hurts. It still hurts pretty, pretty badly. So, if you guys are playing hockey, I highly, highly recommend you get a fucking junk protector. I'm really fucking bad at net, guys. I'm really bad. Ugh. I think this is the last. I think this this is gonna be like the last series that I record for NHL 17, really, because I tried to play goalie in NHL 17, and it was in the beta. It was the worst experience I ever had. It was the worst. I let in like 15, 16 goals. So you can tell how bad, how bad it was. But anyways, I'll see you guys when we get into the third period. All right, guys, so we're back. We're into the third period now. We are up by one. I let in one goal in the beginning of the second period because I wasn't ready. And I was just messing around, actually. I was just skating around with my goalie, actually. I was doing like this. I was doing circles. I was doing mini circles, and I let a goal in. So, uh, I did I did a whole lot better. This guy's, like, blocking me. I can't. This guy was, like, interfering with me. Hey! Oh my god, that was a good save. That was an excellent save. Oh, Kadri. I'm gonna poke him. I'm gonna poke him. I'm gonna poke them. I'm gonna poke him. Taylor Hall. Here we go. Taylor Hall passes up to McDavid. McDavid didn't really see the pass. Because Taylor Hall sucks at passing. I'm kidding. Maybe he does, I don't know. Never really watched the Edmonton Oilers. So I don't really know. So we're gonna hug the post there. Hug the post, hug the post, hug the post. Hugging the post is our best friend. All right, come on. Oh, my God. My goalie got stuck on the one of the fucking posts. He got stuck. Oh, I'm putting my head down. My head's actually down right now. I don't even see the fucking screen. Oh, my God. I came back at the right second. My, why is my control setting? All right, there we go. I just had to change the profile of my controller. It's the wrong profile. I have a profile for like all the other games, and I have a profile just for NHL. Because um, I have the Xbox One Elite controller, so I can actually uh, make different control schemes or different like control like modifications uh, to do the two different profiles. So I can have NHL profile, which I do have now, and then I have. Um, just like a normal game, all-around game control layout that I'm really used to. So, if I change it now, I f ugh, I'll be worse than net. So, I'll be worse in net. Let's just put it that way. Holy crap, I'm just really tired. I don't know why. Uh, it's only 12 o'clock, too. Holy crap. All right. Come on. I don't want to watch these replays. Jesus. Right, I'm going to take a drink of water while they're down to the other ice. Down to the other end. All right. All right. I'm all lubricated up. All right. There we go. Oh, <laughs> I didn't mean to press the A button. I was stuck in the animation. Why do you take a slap shot? He had like a breakaway. He could have done like a dangle, a little bit of dangling. He could have got a round rhymer. Oh, that was weird. All right. So, here we go. Ooh, nice shot, nice shot. All right, McDavid. And say Eberly, Eberly passes up to is that McDavid. Yep. And McDavid puts it in behind the net. In the back of the net. He's playing against his favorite team. <laughs> uh that's funny. Car McDavid, his favorite team is Toronto Maple Leafs. He's playing for Edmonton Oilers and that one I think I believe I seen one game where Edmonton Oilers were facing Toronto. And McDavid 
he he said like it felt wrong being in, I felt like I was in the wrong jersey, which is pretty awful to say when you're part of a hockey team that drafted you first overall, and you want to be on a different team. That kind of sucks, but but Toronto did have the first round pick that year, so <laughs> Edmonton did because Edmonton did worse that year in the NHL. Uh, the draft lottery shit. What's my goalie doing? He's doing fucking flips and shit. Not even gonna talk about that one. Not even gonna talk about that one. All right. Well, I'm getting kind of a headache right now too. Oh, this is a bad night for me. Holy crap. I thought it was a good night, but... And a headache. I almost let that shit in. Oh, I'm tired. It's weird of me. I never... I give up. I give up. Oh my god. I give up. Seriously. Let me skate to the bench. Seriously, let me skate to the bench. Come, let the back end goalie come in for like a minute. Why me? Why? God damn it. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Because it's trying to make me laugh too. Jesus, I don't even feel like playing now. Gotta give up. Uh, I'm giving up, guys. Can I make it back to save this? He didn't even fucking shoot. He had a, a wide open net. And he didn't shoot. I'm just going to stand here. Oh, sweet. That was cool. I never went right behind the net. There we go. Hey, what's up, crowd? What's up, guys? <laughs> dancing, dancing in the crease. Hey, we scored. Oh shit, we scored. We're down by two with eight two with eight point two seconds left. I don't think we're gonna win this, guys. Okay, we actually made that save. But anyways. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. All that stuff will be in the description, of course. And uh, my name is Prez, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another uh, video in NHL week. Uh, make sure you guys enjoy it. And uh, my name is Prez, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.